What up everybody, um, I'm doing this video for this kid that couldn't get Windows uh, or PSP, WXP on his PSP. So this video is for you. Um, I got two different versions, I got a newer version, I don't know which version you have. I have the original version that I got like a year ago and put on my PSP when I got custom firmware. And I found out about all that free shit. Um, this was my original PSP. If you've watched my other video, I got this one for my buddy. Uh, one in the card game. So yeah, this one's a custom firmware, the blue one. And I have Windows XP or whatever Vista on both these PSPs. Um, I've tried both versions on each, so it doesn't really matter if I show you both of them or not. But this one will start up as soon as you click on the internet browser. Well, I figured out how to get this one to start up too, the 3.5 version to start up automatically but there's a little bit of differences in between like this one loads slower it will this one will be the first link the one uh, the original version that I had when I got it uh, PSP WXP when I downloaded it so this is the older version and this is the new version the 3.5 version and this one loads up faster this one's I don't know it takes kinda some time for it to load up when it starts up so anyways, let me show you on your uh, computer, your computer, the computer part. So whatever, you stick your, hook your PSP up, go to your memory stick, whatever, it'll be a removable disk or whatever, you know. So whatever, you'll open that up, and I don't have a memory stick in there, so it's not going to show up. But whatever, say that the stuff's in there, the folders, you know, you'll get the program or whatever. PSP, WXP, and you just drop it in the root of the memory stick. So when you first open the memory stick, drop it in there. Don't put it in a folder or anything. Just make sure it's its own folder by itself that you can see when you drop it in your memory stick. At the root of your memory stick. So when you first open it, put it in there. So after that, you're good. You're done with your computer. You don't have to deal with anything else on your computer. Um, close this out. So back to the PSPs. When you're putting or trying to get it to work, um, let me exit these. So this is the official firmware, and I'll start them both up at the same time. And it's basically the same thing for both of them. Um, oops. Browser. So yeah, they're both gonna start up. This one starts up faster. I don't know if you can put them together. See so yeah, how that one's already started up? This one's going to take a lot longer. It takes like a minute or two. I think it takes like a minute, but it takes a longer time. And yeah, it loads up with the sound and everything. This one has different games in this one for some reason. Like this one, the game list, it has like little sections you can pick out, like shooter games. They're whatever, in their own sections different types of games that are on there so if you're bored or whatever you're on a flight or whatever you can mess around with that if you don't have any games on your PSP and you just have regular firmware because this one right here the one that loaded up faster is the official Sony firmware one see now this one started up took a second um, so when you're putting this on there I'll show you on, I'll just show you on this one um, Go to your tools. This is tools right there. Click on it. Go to delete cookies and catch. So make sure you delete both of those. I'm not gonna do it because I've already got it, both of these set up. And go to catch settings and then put do not use and then go down on OK and click it so it saves it that way. Then you're going to go up to home page settings. You just click on it. And you're going to type in. Oh shit, can't really see it. Let me try to get a better view on this. Whatever. It's not focusing. But, anyways, it says file colon slash PSP WXP slash index 
dot uh, htm. Again, if you could pause this while it's not blurry, I'm trying to get it to focus, but it's not wanting to. It sucks. I need my camera, my new camera. Anyways, I'll repeat it again. File colon slash psp wxp slash index dot h t m I hope that's slow enough for you so anyways <laughs> I'm just messing with you yeah that's how you get it to work and just make sure you do the steps I just showed you if not watch the you know rewind the video or whatever click it back on it so you can watch it over if you missed it and um there it goes it's focusing now but yeah that's how it works um, it's pretty simple there's a lot of other videos out there that does this I don't know if anybody's done both versions but I'm gonna have two links the first one which I showed you earlier was my custom firmware PSP the older version of W I mean PSP WXP and this is a 3.5 version which loads up a lot faster I think it's better I'm gonna put it on that one too but I just had the old file on my computer the only thing that sucks about this one is like the calculator the picture is like a little messed up. I don't know what's wrong with it. And on this one, it looks perfectly fine. But you can't really see it on this one. Because it's not focusing. When I get my new camera, it will be a lot better. Hopefully. Alright, well that's the tutorial. Hope it helps you out, man. And um, if you guys want, subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to put out more videos. I'm trying to get ideas. If people need help with certain videos that... The other person isn't putting, uh, they're not putting their videos together good enough, I guess. They're not, I hate when people put their PSP videos and they're putting writing. You don't want to read that shit. You want the person to talk you through it. So again, all my videos are not going to be playing music. They're going to be talk-throughs. It's going to be step-by-step. -step. Like I just showed you how to put the PSP WXP on your PSP. So, you know, check my videos out. Subscribe if you want. It would be cool if you did. And I have more people on my channel or whatever. So yeah, there's other videos on there also. If you want to check them out, go ahead and click on my name or whatever. And leave me some comments if you want. If you're having trouble, I'll help you out. So yeah, that's my tutorial. Late.